how to use google sites to make a website hi guys welcome back today i'm going to be showing you how you can use google sites to create your own professional or website online for free so let's get started first what you have to do is you will simply open up your sites.google.com google sites is provided by google and it is completely free to access google sites what you have to do is you can simply open up a new tab open up your google chrome and then simply go to your google apps right here in google apps you will be able to find your drive in your drive simply go to new more and then you will find Google Sites right here. Click on Google Sites and it will open up the sites.google.com for you. You don't have to create a new account on Google Sites if you already have a Google account. Then you will simply get your own Google Sites. So this is our basic dashboard that we get. Very simple looking platform allows you to create very professional websites uh, very easily with a simple drag and drop editor. So without any further ado, let's create a new website. So these are my previous websites, but I will create one from the scratch. Simply click on blank right here. Once you click on blank, then you will get this blank canvas right here. So I can add my site title right here, my site name. This is going to be my the main title, the header. And this is like blank right now, but I can insert anything from here. So the first thing is going to be adding the name for our website. So I'm going to quickly go ahead and add the name of the document. This is going to be the same name. Let's create a website for the social guide. So I will type in the name right here the social guide then here which is going to be my site name and then here as well as the page title so you can see right here i have typed in the name and now i can change the font for the site title right here let's go with like maybe this font then i can change the size i can make it bold italic whatever i want to do with the title right here you simply you know select the text and then you can simply change its font and everything. So this looks pretty good. This is going to be the name for my website right here. What I need to do now is I can change the image. You can see there is no image in the background. So I can change that image. Before I do that, let me actually show you the options we get here. So we have insert option and insert option allows me to insert all of these different elements to my website. And from here, we insert our galleries, we insert the buttons, dividers, videos, calendars, slides, sheets, forums, and charts. Then we have the pages option and you can see right here, I have one page, which is a home page right now, and I can create more pages from this button right here. Then we also have themes and this is the my theme right now. I can also change the theme for my website if I want to but this is like a simple theme and it looks pretty good but I can actually change the color for the theme maybe and let's go with this one and after that we get the option of preview right here and publish so let's go to first I will actually change the background color to kind of like create a good header we can also choose header type so I have banner one you can go with a cover so this is what a cover will look like you can see and then we have other header types such as only title then we have banner we have large banner so i have selected a small banner okay this one looks pretty good so this is going to be my header type let's change the image to change the image you can upload an image from your computer or you can select an image from the library provided by google sites so that's what i'm gonna do and i'm gonna quickly select any image uh, from here Let's go with this one and I will click on select and there you go. The photo has been selected and it looks pretty good. The next thing I will do is I will add a bunch of different elements to my website. So the first element I want is a content block and I want it to have an image and text. So I will simply select this one and it will be added here. I will customize it just in a minute and I will add a photo here and text. But let's go ahead and add, you know, a few of the other elements to my website. So the next thing I want to add is a divider. I will simply click on a divider and it will be added here. Then I want to add a text box again. There you go. I have a text box. Then I want to add an image gallery. I want to add a form and for form, I will actually create a new page. So for this page, I think this looks pretty good. Let's just add a footer and this is going to be my footer right here. 
Now, let's go ahead and customize different elements that we have actually selected. I will add image right here. Adding an image is very easy. Again, you simply click on this plus icon right here and you can click on select image or you can upload from your computer. Of course, when you will be creating your own website, then you will add from your website or you can actually search from Google as well. Let's say that I want an image of a, you know, office worker. So I can search from Google directly because this is Google Sites and they provide us all of this, these different options. So this is really easy for me. I'm going to go ahead and add this image right here. Click on insert and that image is inserted to your website directly from Google as well. But when you will be creating your own website, you can simply go ahead and add your own images. So I can actually crop it. Simply click on crop and then you can just crop it. There you go. Now I will enter my text here and then you will simply, you know, enter whatever text you want to add right here. After that, we have a divider. And again, I can add different images right here uh, the same way I added the first one. And then we can also insert a video to our, you know, website right here. We can add a button to add a video. You simply go to YouTube and then you simply go to video search, add the URL for your video that you want to add. And then it is added to your website. For example, I can just go to the YouTube channel of ours and I can just grab the link, come back here, paste your link, click on search. This is the video that I want to add. Click on select and that video is added to your website and you can adjust it wherever you want to. Similarly, I will add a divider again. Then I can add a button, click on the button, add the name for your button and I'm going to add click here. This is going to be the title for the button and for a link, I am again going for the link of our YouTube channel. You will simply get the link of whatever website or whatever channel you want to add. You will simply paste it here, click on insert and you can see right here now this button has a link to our YouTube channel and it looks pretty good. I can actually change the background for any of the sections that I have added to my website. To add a section, you can simply go to this right here and you can select any section type or go to image. I will go to image and select an image for this background right here. There you go. Now I can also adjust few of the more things. For example, I can add image right here and enter the text. So I have adjusted the first page and you can see right here, I have added the text and images, video, everything. And this is what it looks like. Very professional. And you can see uh, the website looks pretty good. Now I can go to pages and I want to add another page. I will click on new page. Let's call it contact us and I will click on done. So this is going to be my second page and I can change the background if I want to. And you can see it has also been added to the navigation bar right here. To add different things to my this page, again, I, I will go to insert and I can add whatever I want to. This time I am going to forms and I will add a form that I created on Google Forms prior to you know creating this website. I have few forms right here. So now what I can do is I can simply just, you know, add whatever I want to this page as well. Similarly, I can add as many pages as I want to change the theme. And this way I will have more than one pages for my website and I can simply navigate from one page to another. But this is the basic view. You can see right here, this is our first page of the website and I can get a preview. Let's get a preview from this option this is my desktop preview of my website and you can see right here this is how it looks it looks pretty good and i can also get a mobile view and this is the mobile view of the website that i just created there you go now i can exit the preview all i have to do is just share this with my team if i want to or click on publish and this website will be published i can also make a copy i can create a privacy policy page too so this is how you simply create a professional website using google sites all of the different elements were completely free and this website is completely free to create you can add different elements to create a very professional website for your team for your clients and for your personal use as well if i were a big help don't forget to give this video a big thumbs up and subscribe to the youtube channel